Hello, this is Les Walkling and welcome to our studio in this short presentation on correctly printing printer profiling test charts through an Epson printer driver via the Adobe Color Printer Utility. After starting the Adobe Color Printer Utility, navigate to where the test charts are located. In this example, I'm going to be printing on an A3 sheet, so I'm selecting our combined A3 test chart. Note that the Adobe Color Printer Utility lacks any page layout options, so we'll need to carefully inspect the printed test chart to ensure no patches are cropped. Under the File menu, the Page Setup dialog allows us to select the correct printer, and in this case, the correct A3 sheet of paper. Clicking OK, and then opening the Print Settings dialog and selecting the correct printer, and then checking that colour matching is greyed out. I can now set the correct print settings. Because I'm printing on semi-gloss photographic paper, I'm using Epson's premium luster photo paper as the base media type. If instead I'm printing on a matte surface fine art paper, then I'd select archival matte paper. It is important to select the highest possible print quality and in this case, turn off the high-speed bidirectional print setting. Clicking Print executes the printing of the test chart. But before finishing, I need to verify that it has been correctly printed by checking that the 3 mil thick black calibration bars are intact and that all patches are printed without cropping. Once this is done, I can then trim the A3 page into two A4 pages for easy handling, packaging and sending. I hope you found this informative and helpful and wish you all the best with your adventures in custom print profiling.